day. We're going to show you how to quickly how to test a diode. Now basically there are a number of different types of diodes. Um, something that the average person might see would be a small diode like this. This is a little signal diode. This is a small power or rectifier diode. You probably see this in a radio's power supply and some larger di power diodes. These came out of a uh, wind charger circuit and even bigger diodes this like this set here all these here these came out of a great big power supply real quick there are different ratings on diodes. There are two you're probably mostly concerned with. Uh, one is the, the current rating, how much current the diode can handle across it. And that's rated in amps usually. Or if it's a very small diode, it's rated in milliamps. And on bigger diodes, it's rated in amps. And the other thing you're concerned about is the voltage, or how much voltage the thing, the diode can withstand. And uh, some of them are quite low, and some of them can be up to a thousand volts. Most digital voltmeters nowadays have a special function to test a diode. And what you're going to do is get your digital voltmeter and look for the symbol of the diode. If you don't know what it is, you can look it up in your book. And what you're going to do, usually what I do first is I test the meter real quick. That one shows there's no voltage drop. What you're going to do is you're going to measure the current flow one way. Which on here is six tenths of a volt drop. And you're going to measure the current flow the other way, which is zero. And that diode is presumably good. Like that diode there shows no voltage drop one direction. And the other direction it shows a voltage drop. Different types of diodes have different voltage drops, so you kind of need to know what you're working with. But in general, they're usually roughly six to seven tenths of a volt drop, or three tenths of a volt drop. Like this power diode, I believe, is three tenths. Flip it over the other way. There's no voltage drop. And that pretty much um, shows you roughly how to test a diode. Uh, where you'd run into a diode, like I said, would be in a radio or TV, um, in your car's alternator. A diode is a one way, think of a diode as kind of a one way valve. Current can flow one direction, but not the other. And, uh, You'd use the primary use of that is to convert AC voltage into DC in a power supply. There are many other uses, and there are actually many other types of diodes, but I'm not going to go into that here. Also, if you're going to test a diode and it's in circuit, you want to remove, remove at least one lead. Like this, this bank here I took out because it had a number of bad diodes in it. It was easier to replace the whole bank. But if this was in circuit and you went to test it, uh, it would make it very hard to test. You might get some erroneous readings. Also, you want to make sure that you remove the power from the circuit before you go test it on it. You need to at least, I would at least remove one lead. Um, sometimes if you just look, if they're a power diode from a power supply, usually what happens is they've gotten damaged or blown up. And usually you can see a scorch mark or a crack there, and that'll usually give away the bad diode like on these there are three tenths of a volt drop and you can just go down the line and test all these these have been replaced so they look good now that should get you going. If you have any questions uh, just leave a comment or if there's something else you'd like me to discuss uh, we could do that too. Thanks a lot